So here's the other one, which is far better and still a work in progress. Okay, yeah, okay. So we had just finished uh, meeting our new boss. Welcome to the Church of the Emperor. I'm sorry, but we don't allow pets in the church. Uh, but I'm not bringing any pets. She means me. I get it quite often. Oh my god, it's so fucking cute! I want it. <laughs> pets, familiars, servitors, they are all the same. It's fine, I'll wait outside. Okay, see ya. The servo skull leaves. I haven't seen you before. Your first visit? Yes. Feel free to pray or make donations for the good of humanity and our Imperium. There's also a shrine to commemorate the hero who supported Adeptus Seleng. Hopefully I said the name right. You pray to the Imperium and Avatar Adeptus Seleng. Don't forget to support Seleptus Seleng on Patreon and Adeptus and, you know, the Empress, Purity, son. Hey, welcome, Jabas. He needs to survive- Oh, it's a he! His icon on Instagram is a she, so that threw me off. So that he can make naughty content for horny souls of the Imperium. Yep, the actual um, developer of this has actually contacted me, and he's very, very nice. Very friendly. You approach the shrine to get a closer look. There are some names of the heroes who support the contribute will be forever will be forever remembered. So I'm gonna actually be nice and name them all. Sappho Sa and I'm gonna fuck this up. Sephomet. Azorion. I already did this earlier. Aegeus. Dreadhunt. I'm gonna stop doing this because you people have weird names. Um, but you know, um, thank you to all these people, and you guys should also check out my Patreon. Do it. Do it. Do it. For the Emperor and Empress. Um, we are also grateful to the countless other supporters of this project. For real, um, thank you to the developer for contacting me. And for giving me hints on things. Which, uh, I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna make magical things happen, so, uh, boop! How do I make the thing happen? Hold on. I need to I need to check something. Hold on. Uh boop. I need to go read a, a DM. Hold on. How do you show me that make the magic thingy happen? There's a magic thingy I'm not allowed to show you, but I can do. How do I do it? I have to go into my DMs for I really wish Instagram made this easier for me. <laughs> okay, that's how I do it. Oh, you won't see the clicky anyway. to later. I did nothing. Inquisitor Cordelia was really something. I'm sure she was. What should I do next? Usually for your day assignment, they contact you from your communications terminal here in your quarters. Alternatively, you can be productive and not be an indolent sloth by reporting to headquarters for missions or additional training. If your career is anything like I've recorded in my centuries of service, you'll want to get stronger. But there are no more tasks for today. Oh god, he turned into a Rillion. I think I'm going to jump to bed early. Heidi 
keeps thinking about what just happened in the Inquisitor's office. Skull, I want to do my homework before going to bed. That's surprisingly coming from a sloth like you. Skull, I will throw you into a wall! You undress yourself and get ready for bed. Are you just gonna stand there and watch? I can't do much other than watch. I'm not actually standing. Right, you're just floating around. I'm gonna go turn on a fan. It's hot in here. Florida sucks. Nico, what are you doing? Why are you standing under my blankie? Come here, silly Billy. I'm not taking you out right now. Finishing work. Come here, puppy. Why are you? Come here, come here. You wanted to hide in the chat room? Dutch is outside. We'll go see Dutch after the stream. Oh, don't give me your paw. You wanna shake? Where's the Dutch you bad? Good girl. Good girl. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Good girl. Thank you. Thank you for the shake. Let me finish this, okay? The last visual novel I have to do today. You're a good girl. I love you. It's called hovering, you inconsiderate sloth. Whatever. I just want you... I just want you to watch me. Actually, record me. I want you to watch this later. I want to watch this later. This is part of my learning process. I want to find my G-spot. And your recording will help me spot my mistake when I fail. Good morning, he Heidi. I keep saying... He I wanting to say Hilda. I don't know why. Good morning, Inquisitor. Let's go see the governor. You enter the throne room. Lord Governor Von Tidor. Inquisitor Cordelia. This is my acolyte, Heidi. My lord. Ah, oh, you have brought an acolyte. Very good. I mean, look at him. How might I be of your service? Yes, I summoned you to the to cho you to Chonar because of a very important matter. My daughters have been, my daughter has been missing for a few weeks. Ladies, please leave us. Thank you, and I can stop censoring. Dear Christ Almighty. I see. With all due respect, this issue is outside our re our remit. A remit? In other words, finding a missing child is not our job description. Shut up. Okay. There might be Zeno's or Heretic's involvement in her disappearance. I see. We received reports of several kidnappings committed by Heretic cults and significant numbers of Zeno ships dropping out of warp and entering the sector. I gotta move my mic, because my head hurts. All this happening at the same time with the disappearance of my daughter. Any ransom demands? Nothing so far. Understood, my lord. We will do what we can. You can count on us. Thank you. Please keep it hush hush. This will be your first real assignment. So it was the governor who summoned you to this planet? Yes. Yes, indeed he did. What do I need to do? You can start your investigation here within the palace. Look for clues, ask around. I would start with the missing daughter's bedchambers if I were you. Yes, ma'am. Good. Now, there are some important matters I must attend to. Report back to me if you find anything. Yes, Inquisitor. The Inquisitor leaves. Alright, so, the first thing we need to do is look up the bed chambers. Now, the developer did not give me a walkthrough, so I am playing blind. And I have a puppy asleep next to me. 
You try to open the bed chambers, but it's locked. This can't be right. The governor must have told me, it would have told me if it's locked. You hear some noises from inside the bedchamber. Did you hear that? Something's not right. I can't open the door. Allow me to try to help you with that. Who, who was she? I, I don't know. She looks very different from people around here. That's because she's an alien. To be more precise, she's a dark Eldar witch. But well, she's not French. No way! Anyone that knows that reference, congratulations, you watch a certain web series. But she's very pale. She wasn't- that wasn't fucking pale. And kinda hot. No Heidi. No Heidi. Bad. Bad. Another whack for you. Contrary to popular belief, Dark Eldar actually have light skin complexes. What is she doing in the city? We need to investigate this. Look for clues. You investigate the windows. There are no signs of forced entry to the from the windows. It was open from the inside. Or she could have entered from the front door. With all the palace guards patrolling around? There were no guards near the hallway when I came to this room. Hmm, there's no conclusive evidence on how that Eldar managed to get inside this bedchamber. What were you doing in the governor's daughter's bedroom? Bonk. I heard something unusual after we left the throne room. Then I went upstairs and checked it out by myself. Hmm. You investigate under the bed. You find a book. Interesting piece of literature. This game is called Inquisitor Trainer. Welcome. Fifty Shades of Grey Night. Fuck! I'm gonna go yell at the developer later. I'm gonna go yell at the developer later. Sounds entirely heretical in nature. Sounds like a best-selling erotica to me. Fuck! Another you. Lately, she, the governor's daughter, has made a lot of purchases of similar books, and began reading them intensively. That doesn't sound good. So tomorrow we'll be doing more cyberpunk, then we'll do something unlimited, and a couple of other games. It is called Inquisitor Trainer. By the way, guys, if you are not a patron of mine, you should check out my Patreon. Five bucks gets you everything uncensored. Do you have any idea who she was? I have no idea. It looks to me like that Eldar is quite familiar with this palace. As if she were here many times before. Hmm. You look inside the drawer. You find a badge. What is this thing? It looks like some sort of pin or a badge. With a weird symbol engraved on its surface. Wait, I know that symbol. It's the symbol of the most powerful criminal gang in the Undercity. That thing is known to have a strong connection with a heretical cult of aliens. You do have the ten tier. That, oh, by the way, if, if you are in the ten tier and you do want an audio sound bite from me, a uh, sound clip, you have to DM me and and let me know what you want me to say. Um, I'm not gonna hunt people down. Just just DM me and let me know what you want. Um, that could explain why the Eldar, Dark Eldar, was here. Maybe. Still, it doesn't explain why she was butt naked in this room. It's an Eldar. The fuck you expect them to be. Still, this badge might be an important piece of evidence. By the by, the Emperor, do you think she is involved with the criminal activities of this gang? We don't know. She could have just joined them, or they might have kidnapped her. I think we need to go to the Undercity to look for more clues. I agree. We need to talk to the governor to get access to the Undercity. Please be careful. Don't worry, I'm always careful. Right. I love you, Servo Skull. Mwah. I love the Servo Skull so much. I'm still new to Warhammer, but for some reason I just think they're so cute. I am. Okay, never mind. Let's get going. Um, yeah. Oh! I have an exciting announcement to everyone. Bosco will soon be joining me on streams. 
so you guys will get to hear my artist talking. Do you have any idea what she was doing? Maybe she was looking for something? No, nothing. She jumped me before I could do anything. Then she pushed me to the bed before I could scream in fright. When I spotted her, she tore off my clothes and bit my lips and neck before scratching my thighs with her big, scary hands. Oh, then you guys came in. Mm, dark Elder are vicious and dangerous. Though I don't think this woman was in any danger. How so? Normally Dark Eldar would have skinned her alive. I mean literally. They are kinky as fuck. Report, Acolyte. What have you found? We found this badge in your daughter's bedchamber. Let me see. You give the badge to the governor. This badge, it has the re the Reavers gang markings on it. They are troublemakers. But they always operate in their territory deep within the Undercity. Yes, my lord, we believe this Reaver gang had something to do with the disappearance of your daughter. Whoops, wrong button. We will go to the Undercity to confront them and find the whereabouts of your daughter. Hold on. Hey, dead man. Let me check something. Okay, yep, yeah, it's up. Ideally, accompanied with the battalion of enforcers or imperial guards. No, you're on your own, bitches. I do not want you to attract too much attention in the Undercity. What? There are other factions in the Undercity. We do not want to incite a full-blown rebellion. Be discreet, you're on your own. Besides, mobilizing the Imperial forces are somewhat expensive. You're fucked. But sacrificing one of the acolytes and a, ser a servo skull will be more cost efficient. No need to worry, Governor. We go there with full discretion. That's what inquis inquis in Inquisitions is for. No one expects the- Every fucking time I make that joke. Every- Fucking time. I have made that joke. Actually, it's not. Never mind. This is the access key to the turbo lift. You get the access key. What are these people doing on the streets? Hmm, I can't tell. <coughs> Sign says, Happy Toaster <coughs> Spa Pawn Shop. Oh. <coughs> hey, Toast Place. Hold on. Why are you talking, honey? Hold on. Why are you talking? What's the matter? You enter the shop. Hello? Anybody here? Look at this place. It's such a mess. We're doing- Oh my god, I have streamed too long. And the smell? It feels like we're inside a thousand year old Imperial Titan engine comp compartment. I didn't know that you can still smell. Whoever made me into a servo skull must have been interesting reasons for it. Anyway, I don't think there's anybody living here. Not even a mouse would want to live here among these rusty 
piles of old machine parts. Yeah, I've overdone it with today's streaming, and I've still got to go do the get the wash out and stuff. So you hear a strange mechanical sound. Was it you who made that sound? No, it wasn't me. The hooded figure suddenly appears behind a pile of junk. Oh my god, it's Mossy! Every time I see one of these. It's the only person I know that uses that icon. I only have one robotic voice, shit. Fuck it. Mossy now has a female voice. Everybody ping Mossy and tell him he's now a chick. Oh. What do we have here? Customers. Welcome. Welcome. What can Sticks the Broken do for you? Hi there! We're just looking around. What exactly is this place? Well, I buy and sell things here in the Undercity. Do you want to buy something? Or do you have something to sell? Ooh, how about that silver skull of yours? I will pay a lot of money for a well-functioning servo skull of this model. What is your offer? Excuse me! This is a rare model, you see. It can smell. Ooh, interesting. Mossy, don't fuck the servo skull. Oh, don't touch me. Stop touching me. Mom is touching me. Oh my god. I love it. 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 I fucking love this servo skull so much. I do. I love him. I want to protect the servo skull. Hmm. I see. I see that it has behavioral issues. Not a problem. I can reset its memory core and put a new program in. Just kidding, he's not for sale. Blur. Not yet. Not funny! Let me know when you change your mind. What do you have for sale? Have a look at my inventory. These are what's for stock. Okay, so uh, I'm not gonna have an issue for the money thing um, for uh, soon. But uh, we're going to save here because it is three hours and that's over my streaming limit. So we are going to come back tomorrow and we're going to do more of that game. Plus some more cyberpunk and some something unlimited and some uh, Bayonetta 2. So I hope you guys... Do